Hey, welcome to the latest episode of This Guy's Thoughts. Uh, be sure you're checking me out on Twitter, Instagram, Google+. Uh, I post these videos there, share some other things on social media. Uh, be sure to uh, check me out on those, um, those outlets. Uh, tonight's episode, uh, it's July, middle of summer. Uh, I really enjoy uh, Shandies this time of the year, so... I went ahead and picked one up that I hadn't had before. This is a Lining Kugels um, Orange Shandy. Now I've had um, some other Shandies by them, but I've never had an Orange Shandy. I've never had an Orange Shandy by anyone. So um, this should be uh, something different, hopefully something refreshing. Uh, something that I haven't had before, so I'm looking forward to enjoying this on this, uh, like I said, this uh, hot July day. Uh, typical uh, Line and Kugel uh, logo, um, the red logo across there. It looks like we got uh, orange shandy with natural orange flavor, uh, kind of like a like a lake setting. You got a dock. You got some. Um, Individuals out there on the uh, lake enjoying some boating or whatever the hell they're doing out there. But uh, anyhow, that's the label. Uh, bottle cap. Uh, typical Linen Kugel um, bottle cap. See if that focuses there for you. Uh, just says uh, Orange Shandy on it. Um, the website says I uh, printed it out here because uh, my. Uh, iPad is dead, so and I kind of wanted to read off their website. They call it uh, traditional shandy is a beer mixed with a little something extra. Lining Kugel's Orange Shandy is our take on this tradition. Each batch begins with traditional uh, Weiss beer, then we mix it with natural orange flavor. Pairs with uh, balsamic chicken salad, coconut shrimp, blah blah blah. But I'll tell you, to me, shandies pair good with uh, campfires patio fires, uh, grilling anything on the grill, smoking anything in the smoker. Uh, this is uh, Shandy's, our perfect uh, summertime uh, drink. So let's uh, crack this thing open and um, hopefully it's a good Shandy. Uh, I know there's a lot of people out there that don't care much for Shandy's, but I'm one of those uh, people that uh, really enjoy uh, Shandy's um, this time of the year. Picking up strong orange flavor right off of it. Uh, let's see. Looks uh, like a typical um, wheat beer. Looks nice and thick, I tell you that. It looks that looks like it's gonna taste really good. Uh, nice thick uh, orange juice looking type of color. Definitely a ton of orange flavor coming off of it. Getting uh, like the wheat vibe. Um, a lot of orange flavor coming off of it, like I said. Uh, Color-wise, real hazy. Hazy, thick color. Um, head died down pretty fast. We were looking at about a, half of, about a finger. Now we're about a half a finger on this thing. Taste-wise... If you like shandies and you like oranges, orange flavor, orange juice, um, this is definitely something I think you'd like. Doesn't have a sweet flavor, not a sweet orange. I know it says artificial flavors, of course, but uh, well, except with natural orange flavors. Um, but it's not a sweet orange flavor to it. It's actually rather tasty. Uh, for a Shandy, um, I do highly recommend this. And I'm going to score this um, against other Shandies. Um, zero, I don't want to see this crap again. Uh, six, I push an old person down to uh, grab the last one. Um, I think I'm going to give this a four out of six. Um, for a Shandy, I would definitely go out of my way. Um, to drink um, this here Line and Kugel's Orange Shandy again. In fact, I probably will buy a couple more of them before the summer's over. Anyhow, uh, four out of six. If you're a Shandy lover, um, 
orange flavor lover. Um, this is definitely something you need to try to pick up and try out. Uh, four out of six. That's my thoughts.